All right guys, we are here bringing you a quick video with five steps to a fresh face. You asked and we're answering. You wanna know with your perfect new lip, what goes on the rest of your face? So we're gonna bring you five easy steps. All right guys, step one is foundation. And Amanda and I both swear by tinted moisturizer. It's great because it's lightweight and you can layer it if you're looking for a little more coverage. So what I like to do is first I pour it on my hand, then I grab my little blender brush and I sort of just dab it all around my face. Dab, 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 super simple. And after I've got it everywhere, I just go back in and I start blending. Hi ladies, so step two is concealer. Now this is for those dark under eyes. What you wanna do is take a little concealer on your hand, blend it to warm it up, and then you just wanna dab it from the inside out, outside in. Just keep going. Now the point here is to brighten and blend. All right, so time for step three. And I'm gonna cheat a little bit here because it's two things in one, liner and mascara. Now look, in my book, these things have to go together. You gotta have the liner to give you just a teeny bit of drama and the mascara to open up your eyes. So let's start with liner. And I'm using liquid, but for sure, pencil works great too. And since it's a fresh face look, not too much drama. Keep it really close to your lash line. And for mascara, my rule is you really can't have too much. So go to town. And I'm just gonna keep stroking. Hi ladies, so it's step four, which is blush. And as a Southern girl, it's one of my favorites. So you can either go with a powder or a stick. The point is to just add a little pop of color to your face. So I'm gonna use this cream blush stick and you just wanna apply color to the apple of your cheek. Just apply, apply. And then I like to use a brush to just blend it out. And so you'll just sit here, apply, and blend. It's that easy. So we've made it to the end. Step five, your perfect nude lip. So a great nude lip should be something you wear every day that is comfortable and moisturizing. Absolutely, and we always say when you're trying to figure out your perfect nude, look at your lips. So if you look at my lips, you can see they're really brown on top and that brown almost starts to look purple, right? Well, luckily we've got a great shade. It's our signature shade called Minted Number no. Five, which is a really, really nice blend of brown and purple. So that is my everyday nude. And my lips are slightly different. So I'm more brown with a hint of pink. So my perfect nude lip color is Dope Taupe. So as you can see, we both have different lips and true nudes, and these are our everyday fresh faces. So we hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Be sure to follow us on Instagram at Minted Cosmetics. And if you love our new lipstick, shop on MintedCosmetics.com. And leave a comment if you like what you saw.